previously recorded. So I'm about to roll it over again. And that's gonna be the last time. Look how crispy it's here at least. So just pick that chicken up, look at it. See how solid that on got? And I'm gonna lay my chicken down on this side with all the grease can just sit in it. I lay it down on this side so it can run off of it. See that? Look at that chicken. Who you know make chicken like that? Child, that's better than Popeyes. Popeyes ain't got nothing on me. You hear me? Alrighty, y'all. He put my chicken. Oh, nice and crispy, crispy and crunchy. Friday, y'all. We is in the kitchen cooking again. Y'all already know what time it is. It is fish fry Friday. Fish fry, fish fry, fish fry Friday. So, y'all, if y'all got y'all some fish, honey, come on. Let your sugar boo show y'all how to fry some fish. I want to say welcome to my channel, Jules. If you was new, don't make it your last time, honey. Go on, go on, on and hit that subscribe button and set that notification bell to all so you'll be notified each and every time I upload a video. But y'all, let's go ahead on and get into this video. And make sure you ring that doorbell. If you don't know what the doorbell is, the doorbell is the thumbs up, the like button. Hit it one time for the one time for your girl. Hey, if you don't mind. Y'all, let's get into it. But guess what? Before we get into it, honey, let me go on on and welcome the special guest to the kitchen, y'all. Yes, we got a special guest today, y'all. And this special guest is going to be in him frying the fish for y'all today, okay? Y'all going to get some old school fried swakat. That's the type of fish that I'm frying. Some swa, well, that's going to be fried today is some swa fish. So, y'all, let's go ahead on and welcome the guest. Grandma. Oh. Hey, y'all. There go Grandma. Grandma in here washing this fish, y'all. She done cleaned it with her some vinegar water and stuff. And she getting it all prepared over here in this sink, y'all, for y'all. Grandma finna be frying this fish for y'all today. Today she is. Grandma, mm. go on, tell the family, hey. Hey, y'all. Tiana got me in the kitchen. Mm-hmm. Cooking. Mm-hmm. I thought I was gonna get out, but I didn't. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Grandma, this is going to be a special video for them. You know, they're going to be glad to see you in here frying this fish. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Yeah. All right. So what you about to do? 
<coughs> that called first. I need some seasoning. Mm hmm. We're gonna let you season it in a bowl. Okay. Okay. So you about to get ready to season it now? Yeah. All right. I'm gonna wash it. Wash. Mm hmm. And I know it should be clean by now. Then you want all the symptoms washed out. Yeah, we want, yeah, we want like everything to go out of huh? We don't want no kind of, we don't want nothing on that fish. Uh-uh, ain't gonna be nothing on this mm -hmm. fish. Nothing but them good old, them good old seasonings. That's right. Okay. Now all right, so go on tell them what they gonna need to fry the fish, Grandma. Gonna need some seasoning. Don't ask me what kind. Cause what kind of seasoning you used to using? Huh? What kind of seasoning is you used to using? Salt and black pepper. And that's it, child. Mm -hmm. That's all my grandma know that. That's but right. today I got her down pat because she gonna be using my seasoning on this fish, y'all. So yeah, y'all, we finna go on head on, move on over to the counter, and y'all gonna see what grandma do next. Oh, then the season the fish. And no. Uh, get to season the fish. I'm meal it. I'm gonna meal it. it. The spiders grease should be hot in the spider then. I'm gonna cook it. So you're gonna be pan frying your fish. Huh? So we need to go ahead and put the grease in the pan then. Yeah, that's what I told you. Okay. When you put in there. All right. So she'll start a seasoning the fish. With some of my seasoning, y'all, and she's gonna season both sides of the fish and both pieces. Alright, so grandma got her cornmeal in the bowl. She's gonna put her piece of fish over in it. Grandma, so what's your favorite piece of fish? Huh? What's your favorite fish? What's my favorite food? Your favorite fish. All of them. <laughs> Grandma <laughs> say all of them. <laughs> <laughs> and this is the cornmeal that we using right here. Martha White's buttermilk self-rising cornmeal. Grandma say all the fish is her favorite, y'all. I'm about to do her thing on this fish, y'all. But I'd rather have catfish, cause it ain't got no bones in it. It got bones, but it got them big bones. Oh, but I'd rather have them filleted. Filleted, yeah. Grandma say she just want to do straight eating. Turn it upside down now. Then it's grease. Meal first. Then it's grease And we got our um, grease over here heating up in the pan. And we got our, it's just a nice little skillet. This is my fish frying skillet. And so we got about half, just about 
a little hat, less than half a pan, just enough to really like cover the whole bottom and maybe like a inch or you know, probably like half an inch, high. something like that. Not yet, it's getting up. Got to test the grease side. So, what you, how you toss yours? How you like to toss your fish around in your cornmeal? This is some of grandma fried fish. This ain't Tiana's fried fish. This is grandma's fried fish. With Tiana's season. What you just did? Huh? What you just did? Gotta tell me what you just did. Oh, oh, see if the grease hot. See if the grease hot. How you check the grease, Grandma? Oh. They, they missed it. Show them again. Oh, All right. And so, is it hot? Yep. It's hot. Mm. I'm gonna just throw it down in the pan, y'all. Don't give a damn about the grease. Grease popping everywhere. <laughs> grease gonna pop everywhere. I'm too much flying. I'm hopping out the pan. Oh. All right. I know it's going to the plane. I know that's right, Grandma. All right, so what you about to do with your fish? How long you gonna let it cook on that side? How you know when you want to flip it? How, how it's gonna tell you. See, that's what I was just telling them about this chicken on Thursday. And how this chicken and this, and this grease and stuff talk to you. So, what, how you like to fry your fish? Do you like your grease up high? Uh-uh, you ain't got no pie. Uh-uh, ain't got no pie. Okay. Okay. So you want to have a good fry like that when you drop your fish down in that grease. Uh-huh, because I ain't even doing no fish. Uh-huh. All right. So anyway, so how the grease talk to you, Grandma? Let them know that. Uh-huh. Let them know how that grease let you know. Around the edges of the fish. Uh-huh. You can tell it's good because the fish is dry. Okay, so you see how around the edges it's starting to get its little golden little color? That's what she's talking about right there, y'all. So we're just gonna let you know when it's ready. Just don't have your eye too high when you're frying your fish, but honey, yes, yeah, this is what you get when you find some good old fish, baby. Okay, that good southern. Fried fish, baby. What y'all know about that? So I convinced Grandma to make some fried bread, y'all. She gonna laugh when I asked her. I said, "You gonna make some fried bread?" She gonna say, <laughs> "I said, Grandma, come on. You can show them how to make your fried bread." So Grandma gonna show y'all how to make some fried bread. What you gonna make? Some fried um, whole cake or hush puppies? You gonna make some hush puppies? All right. So what we need for the hush puppies, for your hush puppies, come on, let them know. You gotta talk to your family. You know, you got some, you got some, you got some youngest on here that don't know how to cook. I gotta have an egg, one egg, mm -hmm. okay. I ain't gonna be the mud, but just name you. Okay. Um, egg and a well egg. Okay. Well fall. Hold on, let me see. I thought it was one over here. Okay, so you need the egg and what else? Egg and some milk. Y'all got some milk? Milk. Okay. 
egg and milk and some salt and some salt that's it all right so we about, i'm about to get the egg the milk and the salt and we'll be back so grandma can show y'all oh you need more the egg milk and salt you over here about to cook some eggs what else you need cornmeal right yeah uh-huh uh-huh <laughs> they're gonna be like hold up what kind of oh uh, what kind of uh cornbread this him 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 is y'all grandma ain't with all that talking y'all unless it's something that she want to talk about okay so we're going to get us some eggs out of him. And then we're going to grab our, hold on child, y'all, grandma over here. Wait a minute, grandma. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Y'all, I'm trying to get by. Hold up. Okay, so she's checking the fish over here, y'all, to see if it's brown enough for them. Okay, y'all, so we what is left? I was wondering. Okay. So you want something to turn it with? Yeah. All right. yeah. You want me to turn the face? Yeah. Okay, I'm going to flip it over for you. Yeah. Right down there, side. Mm -hmm. All right, so we're gonna start mixing up these uh, cornbread. All right, so grandma says she's ready to take it out. I'm gonna turn that down for you so you will have time to uh, mix up the meal. You're gonna fry it right here in the grease, the uh, cornbread. Now, look at grandma's fish. That fish looks good. I just stuck my hand down here and they grease with that time. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think it's just a little bit Look at that fish, y'all. Nice and beautiful. Okay. Now look at that. Okay. Shine. Action. Yeah. Y'all, I get to say action. Grandma is making her cornbread, so now she just put her some of the same cornmeal in a bowl. And that's how much she got right there, y'all. Just put it in the sink, I'll get it. Okay, so now she adding some milk. Use whatever kind of milk that y'all want to use, but basically, um, this will be for just regular whole milk, but we use lactose milk, yeah. Mix it up real good. Pay attention to the consistency because we ain't got no measurements. Tell them, Grandma, we don't measure over here, do we? Salt. It should be enough, good. Mm -hmm. You don't want to take a lot of that salt. Mm -hmm. 
So she's gonna add some more meal to it because it's a little too loose for her. So add a little bit at a time until you get the consistency that you want. Whip it on up, Grandma. Alrighty y'all, so now she about to add some cooking oil to it. Now she about to add some cooking oil to it. Any kind you want to use, except for olive oil, I'm guessing. I don't know if you want that flavor. But I'm not using some vegetable oil. But you can use canola oil as well. Y'all yeah, see the consistency that she got? Is that just right like that right now? What? Your, your, your bread, the mix. Yeah. That's just right? Yeah. That's how thick you want it? Yeah. I'll learn right in the sense it goes. Not my grease in there. No, I ain't trying to put none in the pan. So how much you want me to put in here for you? Come on. Tell me how much you want. Massing them because I know that some people they probably mm -hmm. use different amounts of grease. So I'm gonna pour some in the pan. Mm -hmm. oh, okay, so that's all she wants. I've seen somebody use that much grease before. Okay. I use a little bit more, but you know, ain't no, as long as it turn out right, that's all they matter. Okay. So we're gonna let our grease yeah. heat up. Oh. I, show, show them how thick you got your all uh, your stuff right there. What? The mix. Show them how thick the mix is. How thick it is. Mm -hmm. That's how grandma got her mix out. You want to put it in the spider and it'll go together. Alright y'all, so you see how it's brown around the edges? I'm about to get a flip it for you y'all. Ooh, come on look at your bread, girl. Girl, look at that bread, girl. You better go on, boo. That's that bread, y'all. Ooh, look at that.
So she messing it down to make sure it get all the way done. So she put some more oil in the pan, and now she put her some more bread in there. Burn it my hand with it. Don't burn your hand now. Okay, so hers was nice and thin. Y'all know when I make mine to be a little thicker. Hers is nice and thin, little crispy little bread, y'all. Look at that. Y'all know how to do it. Mmm, 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 you find that the last one too. You just went on ahead and cook it up all together. So, Grandma, what you want to tell them, Grandma? Well, I made it in the hand Mm-hmm. Don't you feel good? Don't you feel proud? Mm-hmm. 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 That's all right. Practice made perfect, Grandma. You'll get better. The more you want to get in here and cook, the better and better you're going to get. Yeah. Okay. You ready? Yeah. Well, I'm through cooking, and I hope y'all enjoy it. Go and show them your fish. And your plate. See your fish? Grandma, hold on, let me take a picture, hold it. All right, here we go. I'll see y'all later, I'm finna I love y'all. All right. So, I love y'all. Peace, love, many, many blessings to each and every one of you guys. And I hope y'all enjoy Fish Fry Friday with my grandma showing y'all how to fry some good old swah fish. And y'all can get this fish from Walmart if y'all wondering where you can get it from. But y'all have a good one and be safe.